Hi, my name is Lara Kodaisi. I'm a cognitive behavioral therapist and a relationship coach. So to mark my 38th birthday, I want to share with you guys 38 things that you guys don't know about me or you may know, but you really don't know the depth. Guys, follow me on this journey and get to know who Lara really is. Da -da -da. Um, okay, I'm assuming that should be from my childhood or before whatever happened to me. Uh, Lara was this jovial girl who wanted to play, wanted to sing, wanted to, you know, be out there. I was just this young little girl who loves to sing nursery rhymes, you know, everything that an extroverted child could be. That's what, that's who Lara was, you know, I was, I was this happy, cool, lucky girl. Um, okay, um, Nara became this fearful girl, this girl who had, um, identity crisis, you know, this girl that wanted to please people, this girl who was scared of making another mistake, you know, because she had made a lot of mistakes, you know, she became this girl that wants to put the best food in front of the other, want to please people around, uh, even though she was dying, you know, inside of her, but she just became this people pleaser. That was who she became. Wow. Um, I think wanting to get married by all means, you know launching into relationships too early or not not necessarily too early but launching into relationships with my identity crisis i didn't know who i was i didn't know who i am so made me had a lot of terrible um heartbreaks if i had known who i am or who i was who i am i think that's what i regret mostly Oh no, I didn't decide to keep it. <laughs> Posterity kept it for me. God kept it for me because I tried to remove it. I didn't know. Um, but I was five months, two weeks gone before I found that I was pregnant. So the doctor said it was too late. That was why. But I'm sure because God, God, God wanted me to have bully. Because <laughs> she's, she's like the best thing that I have ever happened to me. So. God wanted me to have Bolu. That's, that's why she, I named her Bolu Watife. Like, that's how God wanted it. Or that's how God wants it. What is one thing that I'm not confident to, to say to the, to the public? That sometimes I still feel, um, I still have sometimes like an imposter syndrome. You know, sometimes, not all the time. Sometimes I still feel, is this me? Are you sure everything is not going to go away? Are you sure you're not going to, you know? So sometimes I have this, um, yeah, I think it's, it's imposter syndrome. I have it. Hmm. Religion is man-made. Religion is given to people to suppress them. Religion is given to people to um, to make them lose their minds, make them lose their brains. At the at the mention of religion, people become who they are not or who they are not meant to be. So, religion is is, is shouldn't be for anyone. Religion is it's not the way. Religion is not the way. But spirituality is. Relationship is. Religion, hell no. Thank you.